Now let's look at how we manage the reserve market. Instantaneous reserves are needed if we unexpectedly lose supply from a generator. They enable us to bring on additional generation or shed extra load instantly. To see how the instantaneous reserves work, we'll imagine the generation put into the power system by each generator as a box. Interruptible load is demand from industry that can be shut off if there's a sudden loss of generation. This is agreed in advance with specific customers. Here it is shown as several small boxes. The rest of the load is combined into one large box. The risk or risk setter is the single generator that's contributing the most power. The risk setter in either island can also be the HVDC link. For our purposes here, the HVDC is represented as a generator injecting power into the system. If we schedule enough reserve to cover the loss of the risk setter, then we will definitely have enough reserves to cover the sudden loss of any smaller generator. We group the scheduled reserves into two categories, Fast Instantaneous Reserve, or FIR, and Sustained Instantaneous Reserve, or SIR. Each serves a purpose, as we'll see later. FIR and SIR can be provided by both generators and the interruptible load providers, such as industrial consumers or distribution companies. There are many types of reserve product, and the scheduled reserve is distributed across multiple providers. Here is a demonstration of how reserves would assist the recovery of the power system if the risk set are tripped. We can see that the generation and load are out of balance. There is more demand than generation, and the frequency starts dropping. The frequency is headed towards 48 Hz, which is the frequency limit for this type of event. The fast instantaneous reserve kicks in within 6 seconds and acts like a break to prevent frequency going below 48 Hz, but is only required to last for 60 seconds. The oncoming sustained instantaneous reserve, or SIR, within the first 60 seconds will restore the frequency to above 49.25 Hz and last for 15 minutes. Now that the FIR and SIR have restored the balance, generation is re-dispatched to release the SIR after 15 minutes and the return of the interruptible load then follows.